guys, ang ating lesson sa araw na ito ay undefined terms. So, what is undefined terms? Undefined terms are terms in geometry that are not formally defined. These terms are point, line, and plane. They are essentials to formally define other terms. So, let's discuss it one by one. So, let's start with a point. So, a point in geometry refers to a location or a position. It has no size, no width, no length, and no depth. It is represented by a dot and name using capital letters. So, examples, we have point J, point A, and point Y. So, ganito po siya sinusulat. Okay, let's have another example. So, sa real life, ang mga example niya ay a location of a place in the map, a tip of a needle, a dot, uh, a mole. Ayan. So, let's go with the line. So, we see line, it is a one-dimensional figure composed of infinite number of points. It has unspecified length but without width nor thickness. In geometry, a line extends indefinitely in two opposite directions. A line is named by its two points and it is written with an arrowhead. So, let's have an example. So, we have line JA. Okay, we can write this as line JA or JA tapos may arrow sa kanyang taas. Or we can simply name it as line Y. And lastly, a plane. So a plane has infinite length, infinite width, but without thickness. It is usually represented by a flat surface. It is named by three distinct points using capital letter or an upper Greek letter is used. So, the plane here can be named as plane J-A-Y or plane beta. So, in real life, an example of a plane is a R, a piece of paper, a wall, a whiteboard. Ayan. So, yung line naman, ito yung mga example niya. So, real life, so, edge of a table, a ball pen, a pen, a needle. Ayan. So, yan po yung undefined terms sa geometry. Si point, si line, at si plane. So, hope you learn from me today. So, that's all. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment. And subscribe to my channel. Until next time!